Today we're looking at the function f of x equals log x, and this is the inverse function to the exponential function 10 to the power x. Log x is a short form way of saying log base 10x, and we can have different bases in our logarithmic function, and this will change the overall shape of the function. Additionally, we can transform this function through a variety of mechanisms. If a is less than 0, this will vertically reflect our function over the x-axis. If the absolute value of a is between 0 and 1, this will vertically compress our function, whereas if the absolute value of a is greater than 1, this will vertically stretch our function. If d is less than 0, this will shift our function down d units, whereas if d is greater than 0, this will shift our function up d units. If c is less than 0, this will shift our function right c units, whereas if c is greater than 0, this will shift our function left c units. If b is less than 0, this will reflect our function over the y-axis. If the absolute value of b is between 0 and 1, this will horizontally stretch our function, whereas if the absolute value of b is greater than 1, this will horizontally compress our function.